GCEI right now requested over here on investorshangout.com. We actually just got a message regarding this one to take a look at. So that's why we're doing this right now. So shout out to you for reaching out to us. We appreciate it. With that being said, again, right now at 004, that's where you're currently at. The last time that we've taken a look at this stock, it looks like Joe wasn't here. And that was going to be on the 24th. That is going to put you guys right here. If I can put a red line, I can show you exactly where we talked about it. Right here, that's where that was at that red line. Instead of break of 004, this will go on technical analysis alert. Resistance at 0035-4045, support at 323025. Look at what happened here. You guys followed up over here on the 10th with that break of 004. And then, boom, you guys went from 004 to 006. Not quite 100%, but what is that? 60, 80% right around there. Uh, comfortably, multiple days of that move. Okay, you guys, even the following day, you guys pulled back down and boom, blew, blew through it again on the 12th and hit a high of 006. My personal opinion, you guys are going to have a little bit of a resistance level at 005 and then 06 to follow up. Below that, you guys are currently going to have your support level at 004 and 0035 is going to be that must hold area. Must hold area at 0035. Obviously, you guys can drop down to 25, but we're going to put that one at 35 right now, which is currently at the 30 day simple moving average. The buying pressure right now, 3 million, 3 million in volume compared to yesterday at 4 million. A little bit weaker today, but again, I mean, you still have plenty of time. It's about noon Eastern. So that gives you guys quite a time, uh, quite a bit of time here to uh, still trade. Hopefully the buying interest returns, selling slows, will push you guys up even higher. But I'm going to give you guys my analysis as far as the resistance and uh, support levels. I'll hand it off to Joe. Or you're not going to, you're giving it after right now. All right, so yeah, these guys ahead. right here. So I'm not seeing any recent news. Their, their latest press release was on uh, August 16th, 2017. Um, they picked current, their latest quarterly. They had, a, on April 20th, they had an attorney letter with respect to current information. And let's see, the annual report was on April 17th. They had a quarterly report up here as of April 27th as well. So I just pulled that up really quick to get a better idea of what they do. Um, I was just looking through it. It's like, you know, it's not easy to just pull them up and be like, oh, that's that. All right, so let's see where they are. Let's see their expenses. All right, so current assets. So as of March 31st, 2017, their total assets was, I wonder, this is in thousands, or no, it's in dollars. All right, so it's uh, 4000 $260 as of the March 31st, 2016, 17. And in 2012, 31, 2016, it was uh, 3,450. Let's see, operating expenses. So they had a net loss in the three months of $82,500. All right, so about the company, it's uh, Global Clean Energy Incorporated is a Maryland publicly traded clean tech corporation with its corporate offices in Houston, Texas, developing and marketing proprietary technology and waste to energy management and feedstock conversion. The company since public, uh, since becoming public in 2009. So that's that. I mean, this there's obviously you want to go and read more into the company because I'm not really sure, like, if they're in development still or what's going on, you'd have to go back on the press releases. You basically have to do your due diligence because, I mean, for me to go through and rip through this whole like quarterly report for you guys, you'd pull your hair out listening to me. Or at least I know David will. So um, that being said, if you want to do more due diligence on uh, GCEI, just go right to that board on Investors Hangout. From there, you'll see the company profile, the time and sales, the recent news, the filings, the financials, the buy rating. As always, if you have an opinion, feel free to share it with the tens of thousands of like-minded investors that we have using the site daily by posting right over there on that Global Clean Energy Incorporated board. All right, GCEI right now currently at 004. I said watch resistance at five and six, support at triples, I'm sorry, 004 and three five. Selling needs to slow here some, my personal opinion at least. Looks like every time there's high volume, it's whacked down with selling. But we'll see how that plays out here. Moving forward, 
it looks like something's getting under it wanting to push this one up higher i would definitely watch this gcei if you follow the stock make sure you hit that like and subscribe we'd appreciate it check us out live investorshangout.com forward slash live